I'm getting ready for Antarctica. We're going to measure the oxidation reduction potential. And I'm going to leave some things in over winter. So I'm working on getting some of these ready for underwater um, deployment. To do that, I have to cut off the old connectors so we can get them through some of these, these bolts. Uh, that we can put into the place where the electronics go. So I am assembling them and I'll show you a bit of the process. Just go towards the new connector. We have some shrink wrap and the crimp tube. A bit easier to put on before we strip the wires. I'm going to strip the outer part of the wire a couple millimeters longer than the stem on the new connector. And that uses size 12. Usually cut it with the 12 and then strip it with a larger one. Seems a little easier. And there's the outer ground wires and the inner conducting wire. And the inner conducting is size 26. And I cut that about three millimeters. A little bit goes in the pin. Crimps on the smallest on the crimper. Stick it in the connector. I need to trim off the ground wires a little bit. I'll see if it'll be too long. Pull the crimping over the ground wires, push it up, it's the medium size, medium size on my crimper, it's in place, and then shrink wrap, my torch is out of the butane so I'll have to do, do that some other time, and I'll have to put epoxy in here. Uh, to seal the hole and then it will be watertight and the electronics can be on the inside and the sensor can be on the outside. And it's ready to go. Thanks for watching.